let's dive into the recipe in a bowl i've taken some dark chocolate and unsalted butter i'm going to place this dark chocolate and unsalted butter in a microwave and melt it on a medium heat while my chocolate and butter is melting i'm going to quickly crack one egg and add an egg yolk i'm using caster sugar for this recipe you can use demerara sugar for some added flavor or even granulated sugar give it a nice mix till the sugar dissolves once the chocolate and butter is melted we're going to emulsify these two together and add it to my egg and sugar mixture add the sifted flour and give it a nice mix you do not want to overmix it or form gluten just mix it together so that everything combines together to a nice smooth paste i'm going to bake this cake in a steel ring which is around 5 cm tall and 5 cm diameter and line it with some cello foil and then i'm going to grease it with butter and dust it with flour by doing so my cake is going to release the mold once baked you can always remove the excess flour which is sitting inside take a tray and place these rings on the tray we're going to pipe the batter with the help of a piping bag and with the piping bag we're going to pipe the batter into those molds i have already preheated my oven at 190 degrees centigrade and i'm going to place my cake rings inside the oven Once baked, we're going to remove the tray and place it on the table. Release the silver foil and let the cake rest on the silver foil for a couple of minutes before you remove the steel ring. Carefully pick up the cake and place it on the platter where you're going to serve. I've already made a chocolate plaque which I'm going to place it on my chocolate cake and just look at the chocolate melt over the cake. Once the chocolate is melted, I'm going to take some powdered sugar or snow sugar and dust it over the cake. I just cannot wait to dig into this cake. Just look at the gooey richness that is flowing out. You can enjoy this cake just by itself or with a scoop of vanilla ice cream. However, this is going to be one of the best cakes you have ever eaten. I had so much fun making this video and if you enjoyed watching it, please do not forget to hit that like button and comment and definitely subscribe to my channel. I'm going to come back with some more videos very soon. See you next time. Thank you.